Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition where we're picking back up where we left off <laughs> because I died. I took a break. I took a, I took a, lunch, a long lunch break so I had to, I had to remember. Okay, got through that. Just required me using like all like, like 18 of my missiles on the stupid mech. And uh, I'm I'm re finding out how nice the charge shotgun shot is. It's doing pretty well. All guards to cell block one. Power cells, yes. Oh my gosh. Sometimes you want to ignore these because it's like I'm in the middle of something. But every little bit helps. It adds up. You're valuable, Shepard. I could have sold you and lived like a king. Mm. But you're too much trouble. At least I can recapture Jack. I don't think you can. Not happening. You're a two-bit slave trader and I don't have time for it. I do the hard thing civil governments are unwilling to. This is for the good of the galaxy. Yeah, okay. He still he still says that. It's hilarious. Oh, can I not break those? Damn. I thought I could maybe. Oh, yeah, I can. Okay. Thank you so much. I love you. Time for pistols. We're gonna have to deal with these guys. <laughs> this will put them down. Like the, that shielding technology that they were using beforehand. Oh my gosh, please. You know, it says I can do it against the freaking shields, but I think it's actually a big old lot. I think I have. Do I have him? Okay. Let's have him on the assault rifle. Let's try the sniper rifle and see how that gets us. Speed has supposedly increased. Getting greedy. Burning an impact shot. 
Yeah. Whew, that fight is actually really difficult on higher levels, too. I mean, maybe it's not a surprise that all fights are, but... Stop. Yeah, that's gonna... Cerberus. I mean, she could just take the ship, probably, honestly. She could just take the Cerberus ship and kill everybody on there. What the hell do you want? You're in a bad situation, and I'm gonna get you out of here. Shit, you sound like a pussy. I'm not going anywhere with you. You're Cerberus. Uh, I forget. Uh, you actually, with uh, Jack, it is better to be a little bit renegade. I'm offering to be your friend. You don't want to be my enemy. Listen to Shepard. It'll save your life. You show up in a Cerberus frigate to take me away somewhere? You think I'm stupid? This ship is going down in flames. I've got the only way out. I'm offering to take you with me. And you're arguing. Just shoot her and patch her up <laughs> on the ship. I'd like to see you try. Uh... We're not going to attack her. Good move. Look, you want me to come with you? Make it worth my while. Tell me what you're thinking. I bet your ship's got lots of Cerberus databases. I want to look at those files, see what Cerberus has got on me. You want me on your team? Let me go through those databases. Sure. Yeah. I'll give you full access. Care. You better be straight up with me. So why the hell are we standing here? Move out. She's very abrasive. Purgatory's betrayal of the shepherd was unacceptable. Fortunately, it was able to reverse grants credit transfer. May have to take steps against the Blue Suns to demonstrate consequences of interference. I mean, to be fair, I think he is operating on his own, but... Anyway, yes, Jack is extremely volatile, extremely angry, and that outfit looks mega uncomfortable. Like, they could've, they could've just, like, put a wrapper. I think that they actually, some of the, um, the, the, the art, like, had a, just like a cloth wrap around her boobs but putting like leather belt buckles on your nipples just sounds like the most unimaginable pain like i just oh my gosh they'd be gone they'd just be bloody nubs oh it sounds so uncomfortable as i i get what they're trying to do like her she's unashamed of what she is and like she those those tattoos are more clothes for her than any clothing is right and that's the that's the intent that any way that they were going for with her costume air quotes design is that her her tattoos are you know they it's her like life story essentially and she's like you know unafraid to show to the world type thing um what she is uh, but also leather oh my gosh just give your nips a break. She could tear this whole ship apart. I don't know why we're Welcome here. to the Normandy, Jack. I'm Miranda, Shepard's second in command. On this ship, we follow That's gonna orders. go well. Tell the Cerberus cheerleader to back off, Shepard. I'm here because of our deal. Miranda will let you into the system. Let me know what you find. Hear that, precious? We're going to be friends. You, me, and every embarrassing little secret. I'll be reading down in the hold, or somewhere near the bottom. I don't like a lot of through traffic. Keep your people off me. Better that way. Let me just tell you. Let me just tell you right now. Miranda and Jack. I <laughs> think they do not get along. They are two very opposite people. I kind of liked, like, I tried to be nice to her, right? And she was like, oh, and she was rude. And then I was like, okay. <laughs> like, let's try a different approach. If that's the way it's gonna be, yes, give me the shotgun. <laughs> Dang it. I just don't have anything. This is crazy. I think I do like, I do like this one. I do like it. Is it good? Yeah, yeah, it's good against everything. Sure, let's just give myself the option. Why not? Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Uh, some other time. About to test new bioweapon. 
Not on us, of course. Didn't think I had to specify, but Joker got nervous. <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> Didn't think I had to specify. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Mm, look at that. He's got a nice view. Okay, like I, having Jack aboard this ship, like I just, like she could kill everybody on here, and look in the databases herself. So Hadley, how are you gonna spend your next furlough? You really think we'll have another shore leave? Of course, Shepard's forming the best team this galaxy has ever seen. We're gonna kick some ass. I'm sure you're right, man. Hmm. I just. Uh, the whole like that's what I was saying in the last episode, right? Where like Jack is like so incredibly powerful that like if she was actually able to like showcase her abilities in the game, she would be broken. Primary systems clear. But like having her on the ship and not killing all because she could she could kill me, she could kill Shepard. She's a freaking biotic of like unimaginable power. I gotta hit the head, Commander. We done for now, or do I have to use the bottle I keep under? Oh my gosh, Joker. Okay, Shepard. Glad you're back. But keep an eye on that last one. We can only hold so much crazy. Yeah. I assume everything's going well up here. Shh. Yes. Shh. 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 <laughs> no, Kurt, I can tell when it's listening. <laughs> I am always listening, Mr. Moreau. I know. <laughs> I love it. Um. What do you think about the people we're picking up? Well, about the ones you went out with last. Grunt is. Not a stabilizing element. <laughs> Zaid is like you, but it's just my opinion. Not a stabilizing really element. For now. See you, Commander. That's a way to put it. Yes, Shepard. I don't think we have all for anything. Now. Logging you out, Shepard. Nothing to chat with her about. Um, let's see if we can navigate the minefield of Jacob conversations. Like, I can't even like be like like be like hey no not interested. The elusive man I knew it. To you in a debrief I actually just was running past her to see if she had anything to say about that because now he's gonna give me my next set of dossiers. <laughs> um, but anyway, uh, I was distracted. I got I have no idea what I was saying. Unread no, but team status. See, I. I'm always torn because legitimately I don't care with how much skin she's showing as I said like it's her tattoos like it's her thing like I understand like but I can't get over the freaking leather belt buckles on her nipples it looks so uncomfortable but it also looks really weird to put her in clothes I, I don't I don't I don't like the clothes either so we're gonna just stick with her original appearance but at some point we'll probably change it because it hurts me I feel like I need to save. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Already? Okay. I'm not big on forcing these talks, Shepard. Let's do this later. It's not after every companion, obviously. That would be a whole lot of dialogue. I think we're good. We'll talk That's later. good. Commander. That's good, that's good. Okay. We're on top of things. Oh yes, here's my uh here's my heavy weapons. New that's the cryo one, that's the missile launcher, and that's the grenade launcher. I don't think they have the DLC ones like the arc generator. Do we have? Cause I don't have all these. I have I have that, I have the Vindicator, and I have the assault rifle. Like the regular assault rifle DMA. Anyway, I'm distracted. What? Nope, I don't want to go. Oh, do I want to go there? Yes, I want to go this way. We're going to go talk to the elusive man. Let me in. Give me the dossiers. I still have some red on my face. Impressive. Shepherd, oh, dang it. I think we have. Oh, that's right. Horizon, one of our colonies in the terminus systems, just went I silent. forget. <laughs> if it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morton delivered the countermeasure for the seeker swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. 
There's something else you should know. He's got, oh, you manipulative. One of your former crew, Caden Alenko, is stationed on Horizon. Manipulative bastard. The collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew. I don't buy it. It shouldn't be a surprise that collectors are interested in you. Especially if they're working for the Reapers. Especially if you... They might be going after him to get to you. Especially if you leaked that information to them. I actually I can't quite remember what it is, but I... Something goes on, and it's... <laughs> Last I knew, Caden was Alliance. Why is he out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies. But they're up to something. And if they sent Commander Alenko, it must be big. I suggest you take it up with him. We should send a message to the Citadel. The Alliance can give us reinforcements. Not until you investigate. I don't want the Alliance getting in our way. Once you have the situation under control, I'll send the message personally. Mm. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. Oh dang. We might I might have to act if we if it sends us straight. Joker there. set a course yeah. for horizon. Mm -hmm. I've gotta go see the professor. Oopsie Daisy. Aye, Oopsie Daisy. I need to go back and talk to Jack. <laughs> Oops. It's okay. I'll go back and edit it in. Tell me you have something. Oh. Yes. Upgrading my armor. He's. I forget how tall he is until I stand next to him. The Salarians are pretty tall. I think they're actually on average taller than humans. Oh boy. Oh boy, this is where things really ramp up. I forget we have to do this first and then we can get our next set of dossiers. Lilith. We've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Commander. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. It's nothing personal. What is that? Yeah, that because that's... Oh, he's oh, like, that's gonna do something. He's scoping it on it. It's creating its own Get everyone to the safe house. weather anomalies. I'll cover you. Run. Hurry. You're not unconscious. You're only paralyzed. You can still see what is going on. You can still feel what is going on. It's absolutely terrifying. Legitimately terrifying. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, yee! Oh my gosh, it's so scary. <laughs> Hey, that sounds familiar. Very much what Andromeda tries to do, which that that connection's been made a long time ago. That the stuff going on in um, Andromeda is basically just Collectors 2.0. Um, I do, oh, 
I do, I knew I should have gone to talk with people first. I was like, no, I'm on this floor, I'll go. Okay, so I need to bring, I did decide, usually I bring Morden so he can see his, uh, like, neurotoxin, uh, cure or whatever, um, preventative measure in action. And, uh, truly, I am enjoying Zaid's company. Uh, but... Uh, no, that should work, because I'm biotic. Warden's tech. Zaid's soldier. Do I... I mean, I want to bring Garrison Grunt, also, but I also want to bring Kasumi and Jack. We haven't brought them out yet. Maybe, well, they have a small health pool, despite their, like, inc they're very, they're big powerhouses, but they, uh, Kasumi's just not really good in, like, full frontal assault stuff anyway. I mean, her abilities are powerful, but, but Grunt is just kind of a staple to take, because he's so, like, his health pool is massive. No. Do pull or should I should unlock cryo ammo? Okay, we'll unlock cryo ammo. Disruptor ammo. Ooh. should I actually use for these guys? This fight is so long. I am gonna go back and talk to Jack, but am I? Maybe I don't need to. I really don't need to, to be fair. I don't. I'll, okay. Like, I will. I'll be able to talk to her later, but I didn't. I don't think I will miss anything by not talking to her immediately. Oh, I might. I might go back. <laughs> Arc projector. I'm gonna try the crowd blaster. It might not be the best option, but it uh it's it's the option I'm going with. It's of course it has to create its own weather anomalies. Actually, okay, this is actually good that I'm gonna go back because I need to have my I need to have my face blade off. Anyway, I'll be right back. I need to put on a, a different set of armor too, so that's exciting. <laughs> oh, real quick, I actually do have to. I think we have to go uh, right now. I think the episode is done. Uh, I'm I could be wrong. I hope I've been paying attention to the timing uh, better. But anyway, uh, when we get back. I will talk to people <laughs> really quick and then we'll go back to the uh to the to the horizon to new horizon whatever it is called anyway i'm sorry it's a little bit ski wampus um but thank you all so much for watching i really appreciate it and really quick i want to say thank you to my patrons specifically to my sapling tier patrons galamunger thank you so much and reese galita thank you so much thank you both for your support i appreciate it a lot and i want to say thank you to christopher who is my tree tier patron and who is the super awesome bestest thank you so much for your support and once again, thank you all, and I hope to see you in the next one.